Alrighty, welcome back everybody. Um, we're gonna do another live stream tonight. Uh, I figured it's about time. Um, on the last one we went ahead and we finally killed Godric the Grafted. Picked up some pretty cool things it looked like, so uh, I want to take a, a second to check that out because I kind of just like got the kill and then cut it off. It was like a really short video. I think this time we're just gonna start off by checking out our inventory actually and then we're definitely gonna do some exploring or maybe some backtracking because we can sort of relax now I think a little because well, we took him out but I bet there's I'm wondering if there's stuff to be done here oh that is now open interesting yeah we're gonna go in there probably let's see if this guy has anything for us be sure to tell me if you meet a young woman named Lanya. She's a servant to my house. She's been my companion since childhood. I've lost count of the number of times I've had to find her like this. Honestly. Yeah, same thing. Ah, hello there. What can I do for you? Yeah, I think he still has those incantations for us. So this door looks like it's now closed. And we have NPC. You again. I thought you'd receive a summons to the round table. Nefeli Lu. We met at Stonevale. I'm glad to see you here. I have something for you. I found it in Godric's grafting grounds. You defeated him. You should have it. Make good use of it. Ooh, a present? to make a habit of scavenging corpses. Arsenal charm. Ah, yes. I wonder if you've met my foster father. He's in his study. The room enters garden just over there. If you haven't already, I advise you introduce yourself. Father is leader of the round table. I'm sure talking to him will be worth your while. Yeah, we did that already. It's about time I headed off. I'll see you again, warrior, should the fates deign it. Hmm. And if ever our paths do cross again, hopefully I'll, it'll be... Fighting alongside it's each other. Time I headed off. I'll see you again, warrior. We could. Hmm. What, what does this thing have? Anything new? We'd get the rest of that night set. Uh, um. I don't really. I might get some of these. Actually, that. Yeah, I'm not holding any, so I am gonna. I'm gonna get those. Started with that. Alright, so from here... Is there anything here to be, uh, be done? People put the stuff everywhere. Check out if there's anything down here. Ah, uh, real quick, yeah, the status. We'll really just quickly address that. So, uh, we have another memory slot we opened up from getting the memory stone. Brought our vigor up, that's our leading stat right now. Um, added some decks into our build. Kind of going for a little bit of a quality thing. Uh, cause I'm not really sure how this build is gonna go. Um, points will probably be put into Endurance and uh, Vigor as we go through because it's always good to have that. Damage-wise, it, it'll kind of depend on, you know, what happens. Not sure yet exactly, so I'm going to see how long I can go with, with the 2020. Seems like everything down here is pretty much closed up. Um... So it's pro plus four right now. Crafting material wise. We might be able to level up, but I'm not sure. Now, those out of a challenge find them well. Uh, 
Yeah, we could, but it would be everything we have to, to get it to plus five. I'm gonna hold off for a little bit. Because we're already at 48, so it's kind of high. Uh, the remaining points, I might just buy some quick arrows or something. Did you need something else? Oh, I didn't need to talk to you. Sorry, bro. So let's see. We'll memorize a spell if we can. I mean, the only other one we could do is this, but we would need to put something else on our build to cast that. And I don't really feel like it's worth it right now. Maybe, though, what might be worth it, because it's low level, might be something in here. Increases fire damage negation might be good. This is kind of like uh, combustion. That might be okay. I think I'm gonna just hot. I'm gonna grab this real quick, and then I can just grab this one later because it's real cheap. Yeah, I think I might come back for the rest of these a little bit later. But for now, I'm just gonna kind of slowly add stuff in. Really only just because there's a slot available. Having fire damage negation might be okay. I'm not really sure yet. It would be better than not having it, I suppose. Yeah. So now, alter garments, what's this? How do we alter it? It just takes the cape off. actually afford to do that weight ratio wise maybe let's check out our uh, see if we can manage anything heavier here because that's uh, it's because we don't have our dagger on that's why so in that case now let's check and yeah, no, maybe it's because I think we leveled up so we can actually do that all right not bad. I don't think I could manage to have anything else big on here, though. Yeah, definitely not. Hmm. So now, if I go light, I want to see if we have a Zweihander variation of this build. We'll just see if we can, uh... So that's heavy. We'd have to definitely go light on the shield, probably. Hmm. We do have lighter pants that we could do. Yeah, it's like literal sandals that he has on. And I like... It's kind of... I mean, it, it does at least have a shield. But yeah, if you wanted Zwei with the way it's set up, I suppose you could have it that way and still get your dagger. And spells. That's not horrible. 
I suppose, because at least he's wearing everything. But uh, I'm probably gonna stick with my longsword here. I just like it more. Like I'm getting, I just feel some cozier. Maybe we're gonna start putting points in here. I don't know, I think I'll get better damage from this, but the roll, the roll. I don't know, we'll maybe try it out for funsies. I'll go ahead and throw our better absorption stuff back on. Alright, so from here, I think I might want to just go right back up here. Um, there is 100% more stuff that I could do elsewhere. Uh, but I have been gunning for this for so long that I just, like, I, I want to see what's up there. Um, so that'll be our plan for when we leave, but there's a couple things that I still need to do. Uh, this door has been opened, so let's see what's going on here. Oh, man. What is this? Are you that new tarnished? You've done well. I am Enya, the finger reader. I interpret the words of the fingers, envoys to the greater will. Look there. The fingers tremble to welcome you, Shadbearer. Let their wisdom wash over you, great Elden Ring, root of the Golden Order, anchor of all lands, giver of grace, wellspring of all joy. Until it was shattered, the tragic corruption of the Order has taken its toll across the realm. Life lies in ruin, fallen to pieces. Foul curses and misery spread, unabated. But the greater will has not abandoned the realm, nor the life that inhabits it. So it is that the tarnished are guided by grace, called to act. Brave tarnished, your great room is a handsome shard of the Elden Ring. Seek another of its kind to become Elden Lord and restore the Golden Order. Let the words of the fingers guide you. Interesting. Very strange. Um... Well, well, I see. A remembrance of gold has found its way into your possession. Demigods and even the crater of the champions are hewn by the earth tree upon their end into remembrances. They are valuable indeed. These remembrances yet house the power of their former masters. And should you wish to wield that same power, well, I will lend you the strength of the fingers. Oh. Do not recoil from my offer. The fingers guide us all. And you, Tarnished, you are here to take, are you not? Hmm. So there's now stuff in here. Hmm. I want to come back to this, but... Before I do that, words of the fingers guide you. 
All right. It's very weird, um, but interesting and awesome. But I want to check out the item description real quick. All right, so great rune. Godric's great rune, devoid of any benediction. Seek Divine Tower of Limgrave, which stands beyond the Great Bridge from Stormvale Castle. Interesting. So a bit of instruction in here. And then there was the remembrance thing. Not sure where that is. Ah, it's down there. Remembrance of Godric the Grafted, hewn into the end tree, Erd tree, can be unlocked by the finger reader. Alternatively, it can be used to gain a great bounty of runes. Interesting. Hmm, that makes me... That sounds like a boss soul. Hold on, let me check something here. Interesting. Now, what's this? Ah! Oh. I think, yeah, it seems like, it seems like uh, this is Ludlith. Because then it says receive power and looks like an axe, and I think that might be the might be the dragon head down there. Now go forth. Interesting. Okay, so she can transform the the boss souls into stuff for us, but I bet it's only certain bosses. Alright, so... Now I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna... Now that we did all this stuff here, that I wanted to kinda hit off on... Can we do anything with her flask? 
No. That'll be good for now. Alright. So from here... Even though there's stuff to do elsewhere... I think I'm gonna go up here. Because I want to check out what's next. been a long time coming. I tried to get, like, north of the castle other ways earlier on, because I thought there was maybe a way to go around, but, uh, nope. Not that I was aware of, at least. Alright, so we're back at Stormville Castle. Nighttime, just like in real life. Kind of where I want it. And the multiplayer menu is what, what that's good. It's where I want it. What a pathetic excuse for a lord you were. <laughs> Craven to the bone. Pushing me about like that. And after all that grafting, where did that get you? Look down on me, would ya? Godric, you filthy slug. How I feel, feel too. It. Feel it. Feel my bloody wrath. Oh. Hello there. This weasel was... Godric was always looking down on me. He got what he bloody deserved thanks to you. I'll tell you though, what goes around comes around. He had an ugly heart, an uglier countenance, and met the ugliest of ends, eh? <laughs> well, they always laugh like that. Oh man, why do I want to go back and talk to this guy more? Now, I suppose I'm free. Yeah, I'm I'm good. Sounds I he just I don't know, something about that guy. I mean I didn't like Godric either, but talk about beating a dead horse. A throne. Is this the throne of Godric? Godric the Grafted? Godric the God Mode. Hmm. Tunnel. This isn't something I don't know what is. Nothing in here? Do I just hop down? Is there a ladder? It definitely looks to be a way. Oh, there is a ladder. Some kind of grape that looks like an eyeball. Is it? Is it? Is it? A, can I make it a ring? Is it Pontiff's left eye? Grape? Ooh, Grace. All right. This is something else. I see two erd, minor erd trees. Grace kind of points in that general direction. And there's a lot out here. So hold on a second. 
That's where we are now. We're in the unknown. I like want to get down to this road. Get rid of the extra nav point, wherever that is. All right, so that nav point. Oh, that's way down there. Hmm. That looks like one heck of a jump, and even if I could get there. That one is, looks like he's trying to pee on the side of the cliff. Oh God, I didn't see you. Be big mad. All right, is there any way down to that road. Hmm. I'm like almost looking at it. But it's way down there. Oh, there's a giant. Hmm. Hmm, maybe there's another way. You know what, why don't I just... Go there this way. Maybe there's another way to get to that road. But there also look to be a giant down there. We don't really want to mess with the giant. Was that material? 
Hold on, I saw, I saw acquire material. Oh, it's just this. Nav point. Ah, there's something over there that we need to get to. Well, first, why don't we just do that? I remember. I remember those from before. Oh god. Here it's some stuff horse. get to that. Oh god. I do not know what I'm riding into here. I, I do not like whatever those are. All right. New map has been found. Lin Liernia East. All right. Let's really quick... Okay, where the heck are we? So that's that road. Get to the road. Alright, so that's kind of like a big... 
swamp area down here. And then there's kind of like a, two different ways you can go, maybe? That's how we got down from here. Oh, maybe we can't go. We can probably go through here, down from here. And then this is how we got down into here, I think. And we got the frag fragment in there. Okay, so there's a road here, it looks like, that has a few different paths. And that looks like it goes really far north. It's a cave, I think. Another minor ur tree. Another cave. Yeah, so really big area. Kind of like where we are at. Okay, so that's cool. Very cool. All right. So from here, let's kind of, yeah, we got to get back to the road. We'll be fine once we get back to the road. Looks to be stuff out here. Tony Hawk, pro horser. I wonder if there's anything along this. Ooh, another grace. Lyurnia Highway North. Man, this is crazy. So that's where we were way back there. That's our nap point we passed. That's, so that's Stormvale then. Looks like there's all stuff all out on like a bunch of different cliffs out here. Actually, hold on a second. Let's just get a look at our map for a second. All right, so we're here. Get that uh, nav point out of there. We discovered that one, so that's pretty far away. I wonder if there's anything else in between. There was a, a giant way back there. So we kind of came from back over this way and then up. I feel like there was probably some stuff in here. More unknown area covered by mist. Unknown. A complete unknown. Which is different from like this where it's like you've seen it and you know that there's something there, but it's like you don't have the map fragment for it. So, like, this is kind of like totally unknown territory. Like, we know that's probably water right there. We know that's probably water right there. But it does look like there is, like, you can tell that there's a road that goes into here from up there. So, hmm, what should we do? Should we go north more? I do want to get up there, but so far north. I think there's a structure here. Maybe that cuts across back in that way. Or we could take this road that goes to here. Hmm. Really quickly. Yeah, we'll just go that way. Come back this way after.
Oh, thank you. We we want to sit. There's a bear. He's just running at me. All oh, right, that is that is really something. Man, just like castle in the sky, like on a cliff. Another chapel up there on a big cliff. Towers everywhere and like formations of rock. Right. So map. But yeah, this seems like ooh. I think something is out there. That was our nav point that we kind of rode past. It looks like there is another statue for Matt Fragment out there, so I'm going to go for it. I know I'm kind of just like going past up here, but I want to see where I'm going. It helps me think a little easier when I can see what I'm doing. Academy Gate Town. Really quick, I'm gonna zip back. I know we didn't really kill that much, but uh, new map has been found. The Iranian North. Just uh, I'm gonna check this out from somewhere where I know. Zip back over here real quick. I want to come back. Might do a little bit of backtracking along that like highway thing, because I have a feeling there might be some stuff near that troll, or a giant, or whatever he was. I think he was a giant. All right, round table hold. So we got two fragments. You see, we started off with this like limb grave area, and uh, we have Kalid over here, and like. I thought, you know, just this middle area with the lake, like, was big. And then, you know, come to find out that there's this entire eastern and western part, right? And I'm, like, pretty blown away. And then I realized there's an entire southern continent that I slowly start to start realizing, you know, I thought it was maybe just going to be a bridge to an island or something. No, a whole continent with tunnels and stuff, caves. Um, so yeah, I was pretty pretty pumped about that. And then I start finding this out here, and I'm thinking, okay, side area, island, nope. Like a whole thing, you know, with its own little peninsulas that are like... I haven't even be, been able to get to that over there yet. But yeah, they're their whole own thing with like multiple, you know, things going on inside. We found two more map fragments up here. So that looks like it opened up like this really large, like, lake area. And there's, like, it looks like there's multiple vibes going on, you know, in this, like, big lake area. So I think there's going to be a lot of time that probably will go into this, like, couple map fragments, because... You know, we usually ride through really quickly to discover a couple things, and then after that, I start, like, identifying where the the bosses are and, like, what looting can be done, what's just small enemies, and what's progress. So in here, ooh, I don't know, another cave. That might have been a cave that we already had access to. Yeah, we already, we already knew about that cave. Yeah, now we got, like, area in here. There's more stuff over here. I might want to try to get over to this road at some point. 
Because if I could get into there, maybe I could get even further west. Pretty far west. And... Hmm. Yeah, there's definitely roads in here, it looks like. Gotta go somewhere. Alright, I wanna just check the uh, map inventory real quick. Limgrave, Limgrave, Weeping Peninsula, Leonia. So we got east, north. Maybe there's a west? Or a south. Hit the map again. I think it will require some venturing into the unknown, perhaps. Figure out where, like, that other, you know, if there's another fragment out there. I feel like there's got to be something out here. If you will really quick head back over here. Academy Gate Town. It looks really cool. I feel like I have an old map point somewhere. Oh. Get rid of that. And then I... I don't know. I feel like it's maybe in here. That's up on a thing. Hmm. nav points. Oh, I did have the horse. This is weird, man. Thought I saw a ladder. Oh, God.
Temple Quarter? Looks like a sight of grace. All right, that helps. Temple Quarter, which puts us on the map way out here. Yeah, it looks like there's, I kind of want to check out some of these others like little islandy things. This looks like a whole thing in here, man. So now we're kind of closer. Uh, we'll hit that point pretty soon and then we'll come up through there. I don't think we literally want to hit out there. Some of those things look kind of rough. Some mist is out here. Lucky sight of grace. Very lucky. My chat device is going to be dead soon, so I will need to procure a charger for that. Uh, so at some point I will be taking a short break, but I just want to check out where I am on the map. All right, so got ourselves a nice little path that like sort of slices through the middle. So we got Highway North, Town Bridge, Gate Town. Got Temple Quarter, and now Crystalline Woods. I feel like there's probably more stuff all, all in here. We still have yet to hit that point. We're going to get the old one off the map. Oh dear. Not sticking around to find out. Oh, thank the stars. Oh, man, that was lucky. All right, we're going to just really quick pull back to here. Oh, that was lucky, lucky. I was hoping for like maybe a grace or like a little shack I could re-stealth in, but they were like, oh, here's a whole thing. All right, that was really efficient time-wise. I mean, three map fragments kind of hit, hit off on some build options in the beginning. But uh, I want to check out that map fragment. So yeah, we have this really extensive Lyurnia area. Man, we have this whole thing. That is a big, big peninsular area. With a huge lake in the middle. 
multiple minor Erd trees that are yet to actually be like be held, like to be seen and cataloged by our character. I actually do really want to come back to this big one down here. Ah, uh, this one was really easy actually to kind of like raid, but I think there might be something else in here that I missed. Um, and then these ones we ID'd but didn't actually like check out that much. I think there's a boss at this one. Um, now we can actually see what we're dealing with in here. So, I'm not sure how I would get there. To go that way. I'm hoping there might be a way up to here. Um, through this middle area, I think there might be more. There's definitely got to be stuff up here because it looks like there's like castles and stuff. This is probably cliff face. And I'm assuming there's a way to get down here. Because there's roads all through it. I think this is about as far as we got. Somewhere in here that we found it. We like came out of these woods up into here and I think maybe somewhere in this area we found a fragment. Wow. We got this big fort up there. Up in the middle. Big up cliff area over there. We didn't even really like fully check out where we started to, I don't think. I know we went like this way and we were like, we can't really get down. I think we maybe checked out at least over here. I don't know if we tried to come up here. Because it looks like there's some stuff right in here. Really close to that first one. But I bet there's stuff in here too. There's this telescope. I might set a, po a couple nav points in there to start trying to check stuff out. Maybe I'd come over from uh, Highway North. It makes me feel like there's a Highway South, there's a Highway North. I might just take this the other way and see how far I can get. Yeah, I'm going to try that real quick. Do a little backtrack from that first spot, and then maybe we'll start checking out some more of these spots, and then maybe we'll check northern land out. Man, this is nuts. All right, so let's do this here. really remember what time I started streaming, so I don't know how long this has been. Alright, so we're going to set a one to the south. I'm going to try coming as far south as, like, here and seeing what it looks like Oh god, my horse. My poor horse. You're near Highway South. So there was a South. That puts us... I wonder if there's anything else over there.
couple enemies. Yeah, there is a giant. He died. But it took a decent amount of arrows to do that, so... And he is, there's two of them, or is it a caravan? Cannot tell what is going on over there. Uh, is he tied to just like a big post? Mm, that is really something I don't want to deal with right now. Maybe later. Like, later, later. <clears throat> but, so we got a few spots to kind of progress from. So I think that's a decent, um, honestly, I think that's a decent episode. I mean, this one was really just about grabbing up those map fragments. So we can see what we were doing. I think in the next one we're going to kind of deep dive into that area and like explore thoroughly. Uh, that'll probably be if we do it a longer one. So I don't know if it'll be tonight. That might be like a tomorrow thing. Uh, I might play a little bit more and just kind of like, you know, meander around. But I'll definitely do like a deep dive stream where I extensively check all that out. Um, overview wise for the map, I mean, we have a a really good chunk north. I mean, the first two, I knew there would probably be one in like this initial area, but I didn't really expect the other two to come so quickly. 
Um, and it revealed quite a bit. I mean, that's a big, big area. And there's a lot in it, so... That'll kind of give us, a, really, honestly, a lot to do through the next couple of streams. Or we could just do a super stream. Uh, this area, I mean, did take a while. And I know there's still things, like we have the dragon. And I think there was something mentioned in here. Um, but not 100% sure. No, we did a lot of this stuff down here too, but we still got this to do. So we do have some backtracky um, stuff that we could do as well. But yeah, this has been really good. Um, so we'll probably make plans to come back sometime between tonight and tomorrow morning. And tomorrow we'll probably either do like a super stream or we'll do like maybe a couple mid lengths throughout the day. But yeah, this has been good. Hope you guys have a nice night and we'll see you soon.